O'Brien. Dana Stevens out muscles herself, but ball goes wide. They are lurking there inside the D, the bench, and I was so confused when he blew the whistle. Because he no longer does the timeout sign or anything. He just blows that ability the to really shoot from distance that can be unmatched at times from other Phoenix players. Maybe Round not. 11. Do you feel anyone from Northern Phoenix will get a Oh, there player? it is, surely. Oh, no way. That was Dana Stevens in front of goal, and she kind of overcurled the left foot. Oh, yeah. Oh. What a performance. Oh, there it is. Clarissa Allerton. She's finally found the back of the net for Western United. Josh, take us through the replay. Brilliant, brilliant technical ability to bypass Dana Stevens. And really, when you have that much space, you're going to hit the bottom corner. Nothing erratic. In front of goal, one was saved there by Lara Al Hayek, and the other was wide by Alana Shanley. So, I'm just going to go back into the momentum swing. But it looks like Western United have got themselves in another gear. Allerton will line up for another goal. And she does! What a screamer from Clarissa Allerton. Player of the match in my books. Open space, good touch, and then the finish was perfect. That might just be game. Final Five. thoughts on the game, Josh. All credit to West United. They deserve the win. They took their chances. There's the third. Layla closes it up. Title race on. Sure is. And cool, calm, like a cucumber. Layla Abdul Latif, her signature move, and finds a back of the net. So, fitting to your predictions there, Josh, Layla did eventually get her name on the scoreboard. As they go home with the three points. Three goals to Western United, Northern Phoenix, defeated with no goals in this evening. I hope to bring you a player of the match interview and the next game after this. Stick around for it. It's Melbourne Evolution up against Preston.